All right, this is another read off of, off of the side pick and roll. This is where the big man switches on to me, and I bring him out and take him one-on-one. -on -one. Same thing on the pick and roll. Everything's the same. Bulls want to stay low, stay low. This time, when I bring him off and I recognize that he switches out, I can do one of two things. I can bring it out, and I can post up Bulls because he has a smaller guy on him. I can throw it in and let him work. But most of the time, because the lane's clogged up, I just clear out the whole floor. I make everybody go low. I put my big men in the short corners. I put the, the wings on the, on the deep corners so they're ready to shoot if they come and help. Then I want to set them up. I want to take my time. I want to be under control, on balance. And I know I'm at advantage with a big man guarding me just because I'm quicker. I can stop faster, and he can't recover as fast. So I want to change angles. So I want to take him hard this way, make him think I'm going right. Then when I cross over, he's going to drop back. I make him think I'm going left. And when I do that, I take one hard step. I plant to make him think I'm going back. Hop back as far as possible so he can't recover and block my shot. And then I'm straight up into my shot. I'm not leaning to one side. I want to go straight up into my normal jump shot.